Hey everyone, welcome back to another episode of Pop Culturally Challenged. My name is David. This is my beautiful wife, Tony. Hello. And tonight we are going to be watching the winner of our YouTube poll for Christmas in the 90s movies. And this one is The Santa Claus from 1994. What do you know about this? Um, not much um, other than Tim Allen stars in mm -hmm. it. But yeah, I don't know what the point of it is. So we'll see. Okay, cool. Uh, I I don't remember if I've seen this or not. I think I saw something like on the special effects of it back when it came out, but I don't know that I've actually seen the entire movie. So this should be an interesting one. It'll be the first time for both of us. And on that note, on with the show. I guess Tim Allen's going to dress up at the Christmas or the company party. I don't know. It looks like it. No, it's a. Uh, it's not him. What kind of Santa doesn't have a beard? Oh, I didn't even notice. Hey. <laughs> Our Midwest marketing and distribution team, Scott Calvin and Susan Perry. When was this made? It looks really old. Ninety-four. Here at BNR Toys, we're not just about making a profit in quality toys. We're also about families. A great year. Drive safe. Thanks very much. I ran real late today. You wouldn't believe the traffic out here. <laughs> anyway, I'll try to get to my house as soon as I can. Oh, there's the problem right there. Three car pile up. Okay, so he's a workaholic, I guess. Well, he was at the Christmas party, so maybe he didn't tell her about the party and was going to be late? I don't know. I really want to go see carolers somewhere. I don't know if there's such a thing. I don't think I've ever seen carolers. It, it, like, never door to door, but... Maybe like a church or something, but... I don't think I've ever seen like three or four people dressing up... Just to stand on the street and sing. Maybe we need to do that. I'm not doing that. <laughs> Go ahead. <laughs> Let me know how it works out. <laughs> you and the kids can do it. <laughs> <laughs> I think I'd be shattering windows. <laughs> All right, let's go. Bye, Charlie. Bye, Neil. <laughs> What's the step? <laughs> there aren't that many presents over there. Well, that's because Santa isn't here yet. Neil doesn't believe in Santa. That's so rude. Is that true to tell Charlie there was no Santa Claus? Some big kid told him that there was no such thing as uh, Santa. Well, he sat him down and... He told him that there was a Santa Claus. All he said was that Santa was more like a state of mind than a person. Kind of like Neil. <laughs> I think if we're going to destroy our son's illusions, I should be a part of it. Yeah, but you're never around. Oh, okay. <laughs> Why do I always have to fight? It's your mom singing. Sounds a lot like fighting, doesn't it? <laughs> I believe in Santa Claus. I'm not a baby. Well. Maybe it's time to laugh. <laughs> Oh, I got a Oh, that sucks. Oh, Merry Christmas, Charlie. I love you. I love you too, Mom. That sucks. Yeah, that was a little sad. Four hours? <laughs> <laughs> I guess they went out to eat. I don't see him. No, either. I think it's a TV. Oh, okay. Oh, no. <laughs> Burn that to a crisp. Those flames were really big, Dad. <gasps> <gasps> How does that happen? <laughs> Only in movies. I mean, even the pan was on fire. Unless grease flew everywhere and got underneath it or something. Neil's a real good cook. Oh, man. I learned a lot from him. He listens to me. Yeah. Oh, man. And he charges you for it. What is he doing on the in the front seat? It was the 90s. You could ride in the front seat? Probably. You probably could have driven, too. <laughs> Dad wants the turkey. Oh, yeah. This way. Come on. At least we know they got hot apple pie. We did. Oh, my gosh. Oh, man. I'm surprised Denny's would let them, so, let, let them be portrayed like this. Insane Nathan. I haven't transferred dancer enough to say, no, this is too all. That is so wrong. <laughs> that is so wrong. Parenting. Boom. <laughs> What's that? What's what? A 
rose such as ladder? A rose is a word that means it came, and clatter is a big noise. But it sounds so fat. How did you get down the chimney? He stuck it in my grandpa. But what about people who don't have fireplaces? How did you get into their house? That's a good point. Huh? Please go to sleep. Just threatening the Santa won't come with presents. That that always worked when I was a kid. <laughs> oh. <laughs> that sounded like a rough landing. Mm -hmm. I heard a clatter. What, oh, Charlie? There, a clatter. Charlie, what are you talking about? Come on, let's go back to bed. No, oh, that's a big clatter. <laughs> Do you know how to call 911? Sure, 911. <laughs> yeah, great. Stay there. I'm glad he put on shoes. Yeah. And but... grabbed a jacket. Hey, you! What's up? Oh! Ah! <laughs> he killed Santa! <laughs> oh, my goodness. Is the little boy going to see him through the window? I don't know. You got him. You killed him. Did not. Fellas, you can hear me. I'm just looking for identification. Why don't you go call the police? Oh, there, 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 there. Put on my suit. The reindeer will know what to do. Oh, wow. That is so cool. If he puts on the suit, how is he going to get up the... Oh! You could probably use those pants right about now. It's probably pretty gold out there. <laughs> He's naked somewhere. <laughs> oh. <gasps> oh! The road's such a glider company. <laughs> Charlie, come on down from there. Charlie, get down from there! Man, this kid does not listen. Why is the roof flat? So the reindeer can land. Stay away from those things. They're reindeer. You don't know where they've been. Check out there! Such thing as Santa Slay. It's a gift. Probably from the cable company. <laughs> Why is he backtracking now? I mean I'm not kidding. Let's go. Oh. Oh, oh. That would be very hard to explain. Yeah. It's funny that he just kept on driving. Yeah. Oh. Now what do we do? Get it out of toys. And do what? You want me to take the toys down the chimney into a strange house in my underwear? Gotta put the suit on first. <laughs> <laughs> this whole thing is stupid. <gasps> he did not say that. Well, I hope you're happy, Thomas. How do I look? You've got that. This completes the ensemble. I always picture him with a big black buckle. Oh, instead of a sash? Yeah. Oh, 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 oh. I'm okay, I'm okay, I'm okay. Look! It's okay, I'm used to it. I lived through the 60s. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh. How is he going to get back up in there? Probably get sucked back up. He or, kind of squashed and stretched and all that to go down, so... Maybe he'll go out the front door. Yeah, he'll go back up the chimney. The bag will drag him up or something. That's all the bag had? Yeah. <gasps> Uh-oh. Oh, That is a huge fireplace. Oh, that... Oh. That did not look real at all. That's early CGI. <laughs> Some really nice houses he's going to. Yeah. What, is he going to go through that little thingy? Yeah. Why couldn't he go through a door? That'd be more believable to me. What? Oh, wow. It just automatically appears as a chimney? Yep. Santa magic. Uh oh. Santa? 
<laughs> How can you call this a baggy? Because Santa is watching his saturated fat. <laughs> you want this doll or not? Go back to sleep. What a terrible yeah, Santa. Yeah, he's just spreading the cheer, isn't he? Supposed to drink the milk. Look, I am lactose intolerant. <laughs> this close to taking all those presents back to the chimney. Where do you get the celery? From the plate, but the celery's supposed to be for the deer. You leave celery for deer? The reindeer? Or carrots. I've never left anything for the reindeer. What are you talking about? Nana always well, packed up a... in the house I never did was a kid. Mm. We never left out, like, celery sticks and carrots. All the cookies are gone, though, that's for sure. <laughs> wow. Oh, my gosh. God, is he going to break something? Oh, yeah, he has already. The celery stick was more believable than him going down that little tube. <laughs> <sighs> oh, God. He's a terrible Santa. Yeah. Well, that'll be a joyful Christmas morning. Come down your trees on the floor. <laughs> Merry Christmas to all. And to all a good night. When I wake up, I'm getting a cat scan. <laughs> uh, this isn't your house. Hey, does this look like home to you guys? They're home, yeah. Oh, no, 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 no. Yeah. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> That's not good. What? I think it's been worth a pull. <laughs> With all that stuff, it would be automated and not have some poor elf have to come out in the snow to, to do it for him. It's the 1990s. They can do that, though? <laughs> this is so cool. Stay here. Okay, who's in charge here? You are. And I'm not a kid. Pointy shoes that old. Are we on a coffee break? We don't drink coffee. Then I guess the break is over. Oh, he seems fun. Who are you? I'm Bernard. Nice to meet you, Santa. I'm not Santa. I've had a rough night. There's been dogs barking, guns going off. Guns going off. <laughs> this is my son Charlie. Hi, Bernard. Hi, sport. I got something for you. Okay. Uh, now hold out your hand, all right? Very careful. This is very old. That's really cool. Hey, Barabbas. Bernard. Bernard. Barabbas. <laughs> Get an early start for next year, huh? I guess. Or maybe he needs to go out for another... I mean, just, different time zones, you know? Yeah, so. other side of the planet or something. So when you put on the suit, you fell subject to the Santa Claus. A clause as in the last line of a contract. You got the card? Sure. The Santa Claus. And putting on the suit and entering the sleigh, the wear waved any and all. Talk about fine print. Card, you put on the suit that clearly falls under the Santa Claus, and now you're Santa, okay? You have 11 months to get your affairs in order, and you're due back to your Thanksgiving. I'm not coming back on Thanksgiving. I'll shift the list to your house. What list? Making a list. Checking it twice. <laughs> what if I choose not to believe it? Whoa. Uh oh. Oh, 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 he's so cute. You wouldn't want to be responsible for killing the spirit of Christmas, now would you? That's kind of surprising considering he was all about making sure we kept Christmas alive and Santa alive with his ex-wife. So why would he hesitate so much? Because it's actually happening to him? Here in your pajamas. I'll be right back. Hey, we should do that in our bedroom. Put a... A train around? That'd yeah. be cool do without the uh, puppet show but <laughs> yeah yeah no, none of those <laughs> what are they all doing trying to check out the new santa god calvin oh mm -hmm. uh, sc yeah i brought you some cocoa took me 1200 years to get it right wow <laughs> you look pretty good for your age Thanks, but I'm seeing someone in laughing. <laughs> I want some hot cocoa now. <laughs> Best night ever for him, for the little boy. <laughs> yeah, she's gonna think it was all a dream. I guess he had a long night, so. Yeah. It's understandable. Oh, he's still wearing the pajamas. Yep. Ooh, that'd be He's cold. Barefooted. Yeah, that'd be cold. What is he looking for? The guy that fell off the roof, Santa Claus. Yeah, time. Great time. So fast. Fresh. Thank you, Jay. Very festive. Where'd you get them? Two Disney Mm-hmm. Oh, 
<laughs> it was really neat, Mom. Dad was Santa, and Larry showed me the workshop. Bye, Dad. Thanks for a great night at the North Pole. So he got his kid at night, and then first thing in the morning, he has to go home? Yeah. About what you said in the house, who showed you the workshop? The elf. How did I get the pajamas? It's toys and Judy. What's this all about? Cool. Stuff like that doesn't happen. It was a dream. Come on. So remember, kids, there is nothing more painful than third degree burns. <laughs> <laughs> this is my dad. My dad is Santa Claus. I think what he means is I work for a toy company. I deliver toys all over the country. So in a way, I'm like Santa Claus. <laughs> Go ahead, Dr. Miller. Well, I guess we know who's the teacher's pet. <laughs> this is far more serious than a boy believing or not believing in Santa Claus. What was the last thing you and Charlie did before you went to bed Christmas Eve? I read him a book the night before Christmas. Folks, come on. You need to sit down with Charlie. Explain to him you are not Santa Claus. I know who you are, Dad. There are a lot of kids that believe you. You can't let them down. Charlie, you're wrong. So funny. Nothing. <laughs> Come on, Santa. Come on, Santa. Where is he? Well, he could be in his room, jumping up and down on his bed, wearing a red hat and galoshes. Charlie, it's just not logical. How can one man in one night visit all the children of the world? It's just for a time to do Breaks down, what sense is it like? <laughs> Fireplaces. A lot of people don't have them. How does Santa visit those people? Because it's a gentleman. The fireplace kind of appears and goes through it like this. Have you ever seen a million dollars? No. Just because you haven't seen it doesn't mean it doesn't exist. Ooh. He's got played. Looks like you're gaining weight. Mm -hmm. You got more important things to worry about, you know. Like, where are you going to get more sweaters after the circus pulled out of town? <laughs> <laughs> Concerned about what? If Charlie's spending time with you, is the best thing for him. Kind of overreacting, aren't they? Like a secret. Let's keep it secret. Hmm. There we go. Is, is that the right message we want to give to kids, though? There shouldn't be secrets. It's a movie, babe. <laughs> With those parents, yeah, keep it a secret. You don't have to worry about the Santa Claus thing anymore. So how long has it been since Christmas? Because the snow's gone. Probably spring now. Yeah. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Something's wrong with the mirror. Something's wrong with a mirror. Really? Something's wrong with the scale. He weighs more than 190 something. Unless he's really short. Calvin. What happened? Bee sting. Evidently, I'm allergic. Bee sting. Uh, salad and iced tea. And I'll have a Caesar, no dressing, and one of those homemade cookies, a warm chocolate chip, no nuts, and uh, a little fudge of cheesecake, uh, creme brulee, and a uh, hot fudge sundae. Extra hot fudge. <laughs> <laughs> By a <laughs> <laughs> he left the salad on the side. <laughs> yeah, it's still there. <laughs> Finished? I could use some ice cream right now. Okay, now we've got Santa. He's up in the North Pole. He's getting ready for Christmas. A tank? A this time he's going total tank. Wait a minute. No way. Uh, no way Santa's going anywhere without his sleigh. That's a dumb idea for a toy. Have any of you tried to build this whole time? It's got 10,000 parts. And even if you do get it together, it breaks 10 minutes later. Can I see you outside a minute? I mean, it's a ridiculous idea for a toy. What toy company would possibly sell that? You're falling apart. I know. See a doctor, a shrink, a dietitian, anything. <laughs> 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 like he's that thin. Yeah. Oh my god. He's bigger. Okay. Hmm? Well, I don't know, Scott. You're you're as healthy as a horse. Yeah. 
Clydesdale. You put on a little weight. Wait, does this look like a little weight to you? Oh. <laughs> Take a listen to the old ticker. <laughs> Jingle bells. <laughs> oh, I didn't uh, make yeah, that Yeah, that's what it was doing. Fax me. Fax. I got a delivery for SC. USC? Got Calvin, that's me. That's a lot of packages. Man. Dang. Five cars worth? Yeah, something like that. <laughs> it's even we got like red and green and even mm -hmm. red converse. Shawnee, naughty. Veronica, very nice. In your dreams, <laughs> Playboy. That's pretty convincing uh makeup, like fat suit or whatever. Gosh, she looks so different. What? Whoa. He's taking him to court? Shawnee? Oh, that is so sad. Mind if I talk to you for a minute? He's He's not, he hasn't done anything wrong though. No. Laura, don't you remember when you stopped believing in Santa Claus? I was Charlie's age. I wrote Santa a letter every week that year. Boy, I really wanted a mystery day game. I got everything except mystery date. I was three. three? And it was an Oscar Mayer weenie whistle. He remembers it? At three? Wow. Where's Charlie? I want to talk to him. He's with the judge. Yeah. It's all okay. I call the judge everything. I'm sorry to do this in light of the holiday season, but I'm granting the petition of Dr. and Mrs. Miller. All of your visitation rights are suspended pending a hearing after the first of the year. He wasn't hurting him. No, he just gained some weight and grew a beard. That's so sad, he's got the globe. Hey, Neil. Scott. You're not supposed to be here. Don't make me beat you up, Neil. Oh, would Santa really beat someone up? I'm this close. He's not Santa. He is too, Santa! We went to the North Pole together. Remember! Didn't think we were going to need uh, tissue for this one. <laughs> Thank you, Charlie. Thank you. Love you, Dad. Could you just guys leave us alone for a minute so I can say goodbye to him properly? Boy, this bird is dry. Haven't you people heard about basting? Whoa! Bernard! Bernard, can I go? Please, can I go, Bernard? Okay with me. She gonna, uh, is she going to call the police Bernard? thinking he yeah. was kidnapped? Yep. Leaves himself to be Santa Claus. Ladies and gentlemen, this one <laughs> Santa, this is Quentin, head of research and development. Like Q from James Bond. Q makes all the gadgets in James Bond. What happens if I fall off the roof? Oh, yeah? Yeah. Hold on. Hello? Mom? Oh, Charlie. I know the yell still the new play. We're trying for a vertical takeoff. <laughs> vertical takeoff. <laughs> Fireplaces will no longer be a problem. <laughs> what about his face? Yeah. Now, Calvin is to be apprehended unharmed. Probably be dressed like Santa Claus. <laughs> it's like he's an astronaut or something. <laughs> the right stuff. Check out the beard. It's gotten so much bigger. Yeah. Oh, it's Christmas Eve, right? Man, yeah, that's gotten really big. Every mall Santa's gonna get harassed. <laughs> How much is Santa? Did you make the car? Comet, it means a lot to me. So they've only shown Comet. What happened to Rudolph? He was the main one, wasn't he? 
he mm -hmm. shouldn't be? Shouldn't he be? I don't know. Oh, they got the vertical t vertical takeoff working. Turn to the right. What's this? Coco dispenser. Coco dispenser. <laughs> Same girl from last year. Your father this year. You grown. <laughs> I thought he was lactose intolerant. It's soy milk. You said you're lactose intolerant. <laughs> <laughs> He's gonna get mobbed by a SWAT team or something. <laughs> Looks like it. That was only three of them. Nice and easy now. His hat fell. Scott Calvin, we're bringing him out. <laughs> Let him go. Let Santa go. Where are the kids up? It should be like past midnight by the time he got there. I don't know. Maybe it's not that late, really. We've got a problem. Time to deploy ELFS. Elves. Let's go. Effective liberating flight squad. Are they gonna fly there? It looks like do they have rocket packs or something? Is that what those are? Maybe. The ballroom was just balls. <laughs> they only send four? That's all they need. Name? Chris Kringle. Babo Natale. Pears Nicole. Papa Gijo. Papa Gijo is not Santa Claus. Why is there Christmas trees on top of the house? It's the house. It's the trees behind the house. Oh. In the backyard. Charlie? Yeah? Don't worry. We're the good guys. The police are watching this place. Yeah, they probably are. <laughs> oh, ow, ow, that's gotta be hot. He's not reporting that. <laughs> They'll think he's crazy. Yeah, that's exactly what I was going to say. We're looking for Santa Claus. Go home, kids. I am now. Simple. Not just for decoration. <laughs> Why aren't they running? Yeah. Oh, I so much. I think it's a much better idea that you stay here with your mom and Neil. Really? We're a family. You, me, your mom, and Neil. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, listen, there's a, there's a lot of kids out there, okay? Millions of kids. You believed in me when nobody else did. You helped make me see it. <sighs> Will we ever watch a happy movie? <laughs> this is a happy movie. It's gonna have a happy ending, I'm sure. It's you. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, of course, Neil. Santa. <laughs> <laughs> it's my Christmas present for you at the um, the custody papers. I want you to come and see Charlie as often as you can. See? It's got a happy ending. What's all this boo hooing going on here? Hey, how are you doing? <laughs> Charlie, you still got the glass ball, right? Yeah. Well, all you gotta do is shake it whenever you want to see your dad. And now they're sending the SWAT guys. <laughs> oh. <laughs> it's 
Let's hope some cop doesn't start shooting at him. Merry Christmas to all. To all a good night. I'm sorry, Charlie. <laughs> You're just denying your inner child. You're gonna make a great psychiatrist one day, kid. I think I'm gonna go into the family business. <laughs> Look out below! <laughs> he gets a little. <laughs> Was it his house the whole time in the globe? I don't know. Mom, stupid ball's not working. Hey, sport. Dad! I've been gone, what, 10 minutes? <laughs> Do you want to go for a quick ride? Of course, it's up to your mom. <laughs> go on, get out of here. Bye, Mom! Okay, that was the Santa Claus. What did you think? I liked it, uh -huh. but I wasn't expecting to cry. I just <laughs> want to see a happy movie. I'm so tired of crying. Ah, yeah, it was good. I, I enjoyed it. I, I, I do remember seeing some of the scenes. Like I think, I think they showed the part where he's like gaining weight or something. You know, like or or like when he morphed back into having the beard and the gray hair. Yeah. I remember seeing that scene before, but I think that was because it was on something like, you know, how are the effects done or something like that. Yeah. But but yeah, I didn't remember the movie. But yeah, it was cool. It was it was a good movie. Yeah. It was it was nice. It was entertaining. Um I didn't fall asleep though I'm very tired. Um <laughs> but I just want to see a happy movie. Well I mean, that was a happy movie. I cried. I ugly cried. But it wasn't a sad movie. It was. It was. It was tears of joy, wasn't it? No, I was sad for the little boy. <laughs> okay. Anyway. Well, well, I enjoyed it. Did you at least enjoy it? It was entertaining. Yes. Okay, you did enjoy it. Okay. Well, thank you to everybody who voted for it. We really liked it. I know that there is a part two and three. Yeah, somebody mentioned that in the comments mm -hmm. of, yeah. you know, we needed to do all of them or something. Yeah. Is there some, something you'd want to do? Sure, as long as it's not sad. Okay. We'll Can we just watch a joyful movie? Um, I'm trying. <laughs> yeah, I think like, I think the part three was actually made very recently. So it, oh, okay. I don't know if like the, the original kids back in it or... I know nothing about the the other two at all, so yeah, I I don't know. I mean, but yeah, maybe we'll try to try to watch those as well. We'll see how things go. I apparently don't watch enough movies, and this is why we're doing this. So yeah, yep. Here I am. By this time next year, you're gonna have a lot of movies under your belt. We'll see. <laughs> so, all right. Well, anything else you want to say? No. Everybody have a great weekend. Yeah. Thank you for the recommendation. Thank you for the, for voting to everybody who voted. And if you like this, if you're still around, uh, click the like button, subscribe if you're not, and we will see you next time. Bye-bye.